Hi there, welcome to another AutoCAD tip with Lynn Allen. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope everything's going well with you. Today I'm gonna to share with you a command that came out inside of AutoCAD 2009. So as long as you have 2009 or higher, you're in good shape and you can use this command. I recently started using it again inside of AutoCAD 2013 because I got a little bit of an upgrade, but now I'm wondering why I haven't been using it all along because it's an awesome command. You're gonna to wanna to use it. All right, what command is that? It's called quick view drawing. Now most of us work with multiple open drawings at a time. Sometimes we have multiple layouts in those open drawings and going from one drawing to a layout and another drawing can get pretty cumbersome. Now, I've used control key combinations, I've grabbed it from the menus, but I'm telling you quick view drawing, that is the fast way to go. That's the speedy fast track. So let me show you how easy it is and, and, and how it works. It's easy to get to to begin with because it's on the status bar. You'll see it right down there at the bottom of the screen. I'm gonna go ahead and click on Quick View Drawings and you'll see that it shows me all of my open drawings. You'll also see that I can easily take a look at the layouts from those open drawings. Now, if I just wanna to go to one of those layouts, I just click and we're good to go. But I can also take a look at this. I can do a plot or I can do a, a publish, also really nice. From, for any one of those layouts, I don't have to go to it. I can just click on plot and I'm good to go. And what else can I do? Well, I can save a drawing file from inside a quick view drawings. I can delete, I mean, basically it just closes the drawing file. It doesn't delete the drawing file. Um, it'll ask you to save if you need to save. But let me show you a couple of other kind of cool tips about quick view drawings that you probably don't know. All right, I'm gonna come over here to this particular drawing because as you can see, it has many, many, many layouts. So, and incidentally, if it's a drawing that's not, hasn't been saved on the recent release, model space is going to look just like that. If you saved it on the recent release, it'll actually show you what model space looks like. But, uh, so don't freak out. You can read it says model. You know exactly what that means, right? So if I hold down my control key, here's a little tip. I don't know if you're ever going to have the time to do this, but it's kind of fun. And you roll your mouse wheel, you can actually make these bigger or smaller. So maybe you can't tell which layout to go to. You could very quickly just just make them a little bit bigger so it's easier to see. And you'll also see that as I move my cursor to the edge of the display, you'll see that I get an arrow letting me know that, you know, so I can scroll through all of my open layouts. That's kind of nice too. Let's see, what else? Well, while I'm in here, I could start a new drawing. <laughs> I can open an existing drawing. It's just another option that you can do inside of Quick View Drawings. But I'm just going to quickly go to a different layout. Let's say I want to go here. Once you click on it, it sends you there and escape. It's gonna get you out of quick view drawings. That's the fastest way to get out if you ask me. So what's new inside of AutoCAD 2013? Just a tiny little change. Can you see how it's very clear what the current drawing is and the current layout is right there? It's very clear, big and green and bold. And uh, it's got a, a very obvious border and the text itself is bolded. So it's a little tricky in the past to tell which drawing you were in but you could just look at the screen. <laughs> that would also work. That would also tell you the layout and the drawing that you were in, wouldn't it? <laughs> so it's a nice change that caused me to start using it again. I'm glad for that, but if you're not an AutoCAD 2013, you're still gonna love it. All right, so thank you so much for joining me and I'm gonna see you back here in two more weeks.